chanting Hare Krishna is uh, especially recommended for this age as a form of reawakening our Krishna consciousness within the heart. Uh, and it is done in different ways. Chanting is different, uh, practice in different ways. Uh, we chant on our beats, no, on our japa mala. Uh, we are singing the holy names, uh, using different instruments, and chanting can also be done in congregation, uh, singing and dancing, accompanied by different instruments. Uh, so this is uh, the chanting, is uh, the Yuga Dharma, uh, and it contains the names of God. The names of God are very powerful. Uh, why is this? Uh, because God and His name are not different. Uh, actually, Krishna or God is within this uh, name. It's actually not different from Him. Uh, so when we come in touch you know, with the chanting of the holy name, we are affected, you know, we are purified, we become very fortunate. Uh, even if you don't understand the chanting of the holy names, uh, you also benefit. Mm, yeah. Just like Prabhupada used to say that even in lower forms of life, the plants, the insects, the birds, animals, when they're exposed to the chanting of holy names, they also become benefited, they also become purified, they become also very fortunate.